أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Good boy All right Here you go. Um, I have to tell you something. Yeah, tell me something. When are we going to do the song? Which song? The letter song? We already did the songs. Okay. What? Open your cam, please. I can't see you. Okay. All right. So read this line. Without things? Yep. Alam taro kay farfala robuka. Next. Be us happy feel. All right. Alam hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. First of all, it is faala. I should be deeper from the middle throat. Faala. Say faala. Faala. Good boy. Secondly, you have to apply Yai Madha rule here, which means you have to stretch the feel for one second. Be a shabil feel, like this. Be a shabil feel. Good job. Next verse. Alam yajal. All right. Daida. Yeah. So, so here on Jim, apply Kalkala and do not stretch the Ayn. Yajal. Yajal, not al. It's al. Yajal. Yeah, yajal. Yajal. Good boy. Next. Kaid the hum. Yeah. Fi the lil. Fi fi has to be stretched. Yeah, mother rule. Remember. Fi the lil. Good boy. Okay. Which rule did we apply here? Yailin. Yailin. Good boy. Mashallah. Okay, which rule did we apply here? Yeah, Madha. Yeah, Madha. Good job. Which rule did we apply on Jim? Kolkola. Good boy. Okay, which rule did we apply here? Yeah, lean. Yeah, lean. Brilliant, brilliant. Which rule did we apply here on this word? Yeah, yeah Madha. Good boy. All right. Oh. Okay, do the. You forgot one. You forgot one. What? The lamb no. in the yeah. No, no, no. I didn't forget it. I already know that you know about Yaimada Yailin, so I didn't need to ask you about this. Anyway, no. do the spelling of this one now. Wa arsala. Hmm, good job. Now, all of the nine together. Okay. Wa arsala is correct. Next one. Okay, wait. Can I say it on my mind first? Yeah. Allahum. Uh, ha has a zir below it, not pish. Hmm? Ha, this ha has a zir uh, below it, not pish. Uh, yeah. Allahum. 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 Good boy. Next. Tyron. Yeah. Ba. No. Aba. Yeah. B. B. Uh, Aba. B. Yeah, you have to read the lamb also. Oh. Lamb. B. La. Uh. We are stopping here so the zubber of lamb will turn into jasm. Bila. No. Or is it beel? Yeah, beel, it's, beel. it's beel. Stretch it. Beel. Yeah, it's abba beel. Abba beel. What is Alim Madda? Tell me. If any letter has a zubber on it, next to it's all of it, no sign. Mm -hmm. Then what do we do? We stretch it for one second. Good job. Yeah. That's why we stretch the bar here. So, Abba, Bil. 
Ababil. So read one more time. Ababil. No, 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 the complete line from here. Wa arsala. Yeah. Alay him. Yeah. Toy run. Yeah. Ababil. Good job, Ababil. Okay, do the spelling of this one now. Or read. Yeah. No, you we didn't do it. Oh, sorry. Can I do it without spelling? You, it is your choice. Do it without spelling if you want to. Can I see my head first? Yeah, obviously. No problem with that. What do me him? What did you say? Say it again. That do me him. There is no zabar on raw. It's not hmm? tara. You said tara me him. Oh. Yeah. So there is Tar no zabar on. What? Tar Tar me him. Good boy. Next. Biha. Wait, 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 wait. One second. Biha ho. Raw. Look, spellings are for your own ease. Okay, if you do the spellings, you will be able to read it uh, easily. No. I, it is my suggestion that you do the spellings first. I know, but I don't like when I do but, spell. No, the problem is that you said biha, whereas the ha has a zed. It is not has a zabar. Be -he, be -he, be -he. <laughs> yeah, secondly, you said ha, whereas this is the jim. The dot on <laughs> this letter is at the bottom, not at the top. That's why I was suggesting to do the spellings first. But it is your your choice if you want to read it directly. Then read it there. B C J R O. Wait one second. B P J R O. Con. No con. What? No, this is the letter ta, round ta, and it is two zeros here, not two zeros. I said it earlier. I thought it was golf, but no, I said it right earlier. But thumb, Okay, I think I'm ready for this. But but the thing is, this is not thumb. This is tim because it is two zeros, not two zeros. Yeah. 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 Now you read it. Pihi ja rot. Then mean okay hold on now you asked about gunna earlier in earlier lessons do you remember uh -huh. i will teach you gunna today wait is it gonna the bad thing no it's a good thing gunna is a good thing who told you that gunna no, is the, one, huh? the one that means you did a sin that's the gunna i was talking about Oh no, that is guna, man, guna. That is not. <laughs> this is gunna. This is uh, from Gain. That is from Gaf. That's the uh, word of Urdu. <laughs> this is Arabic. This is from Gain. This is gunna, gunna, not guna. That is guna. Guna is sin. Guna. That is from Gaf. From G. Guna. But this is gunna. Gunna is a separate thing, man. <laughs> You are so funny, That's man. That's what I was talking about. <laughs> Gunna. That's mm. what I was talking about. Mm. You were talking about Gunna? Mm -hmm. I want you to teach me that. You want to? Uh, you want me to tell you about the sin? Yes. So what is a sin? Sin to tell a lie is a sin. To not respect our parents and teachers is a sin. To not take care of our uh, small animals is a sin. Mm, to steal is a sin mm, to to fight unjustly to fight and to bully other people is a sin to abuse and to curse is a sin there are so many sins the biggest sin mm. is to to worship other than allah any to for example to worship the statues the sun the moon or the any other creation that is also that is the most severe sin that's the most biggest sin so we should only worship allah alone because allah is our only creator and and earlier i did namaz 
Yeah, we have to do our namaz also. If we do not namaz, that's also a sin. Yeah, because you, uh, but you are very young. Namaz is not obligatory on you. When you will reach to 10, when you will become 10 years old, when you will get 10 years old, then namaz will be obligatory. But we have to learn the namaz at this, at your age. This is, yeah. All right. So I will today tell, tell you about the rule Ghunna. That's Ghunna from Ghain and Ghunna. Okay, this is Ghunna. Whenever Meme has a Tashdeed. Okay, before moving on to Ghunna, I will remind you of the previous uh, rule which I taught you earlier. That is Tashdeed. So do you remember whenever a letter has a Tashdeed, this W sign on it? We have to connect the previous letter with it and we have to read that letter two times and we have to press it for half a second. Do you remember these things? Uh -huh. Good job. Now, in the case of meme and in the case of noon, the things are uh, a little bit different. In other letters, if there is tashtid, we press those letters for half a second. Uh, however, if the tashtid is on either noon or meme, we press these letters for one second, not half a second. This is the double length. The length is doubled. So if there is, for example, uh, uh, tashtid on, on meme, and before it there is a meme like this, and there is a zair below it, and on, on the noon there is a tashtid, and upon it there is a zabar, we will say it like this. Minna say minna. Minna. Okay, in Gunna, unlike Ikhfa, in Ikhfa we do not touch our tongue, but in Gunna we have to touch our tongue to the roof. So it is minna. Minna. Not minna. You are not touching your tongue. You have to touch your tongue to the roof of the mouth. Minna. Minna. Yeah. Minna. Minna. Brilliant. You are a genius. Minna. Minna. Yeah. Minna. Minna. Good job. You are reading perfectly, mashallah. That's great. You are a genius, man. Minna. Wait. Minna. Yeah. You have to connect. You have to connect the meme with the noon immediately. You have to touch the tongue to the roof of the mouth immediately. Okay. Minna. Minna. Brilliant. Good job. Similar is the case with meme. You have to close your lips for one second while uh, uh, connecting any letter with the meme. So for example, here we will connect this round ta with this meme we, and apply gunna here. So it is tim. Okay, we will connect the ta with the meme immediately. We will not stretch the ta. Instead, we will stretch the meme instead. Uh, stre by stretching, I mean by pressing. We will press the meme. Okay, so it is tim. Say tim. Tim. That's it. So easy. And on the noon, we will apply ikhfa. Okay, because noon has a jazam on it and next letter is seen, which does not belong to the throat letter. So it will be tim. Good job. All right. So this is called Gunna. So do you understand what is Gunna? Hmm? So what is Gunna? Explain to me. Okay, that's hard. No, no, it's very easy. If noon or meme has a tashdeed on it, repeat the statement. If noon or meme if, has a tashdeed on it. If noon or meme has a tashdeed on it. Then we press these letters for one second. Then we press these letters for one second. This is Gunna. <laughs> Only two sentences. So easy. This is good now. If, if, if noon or meme has a tashtid on it, we apply gunna on it? We apply gunna on it, which is pressing for one second, which means pressing for one second. Got it? All right. -o. Okay. Now, gunna applies in different uh, situations. Uh, there is another situation where gunna applies. What? Do you want to ask anything? Yeah, go on. It is 747. It's almost time for Quran class is over. Yeah, we have 13 minutes left. All right. So 
if meme has a jazam on it, repeat the statement. If meme has a jazam on it. If meme has a jazam on it. And the next letter is ba. And the next letter is ba. Then also we apply guna on meme. Then we also apply guna on meme. Yeah, if, if there is any the other letter other than ba, we do not apply gunna. But if there is a meme with a jazam on it and next to it is ba, then we apply gunna. Then also we apply gunna on meme. So on meme, we apply gunna two, uh, on two occasions. First, if there is tashdeed on meme. And secondly, if there is jazam on meme and the next letter is ba. So in both of these cases, we apply gunna. Do you understand me? Uh -huh. All right. So now we will read this word. Tarmihim. First of all, this part you will read. Tarmihim. 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 Okay, do not apply kalkla on rat. Not tar. It's tar. Tarmihim. 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 Good job. Now the second part. Bihijaratim. Bihijaratim. Good job. Bihijaratim. 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 Yeah, good job. Now we will combine the two sounds. Tarmihim bihijaratim. Tarmihim biha bihijaratim. Good job. Tarmihim bihijaratim. Tarmihim okay if you do not move your chair if you sit still you will read more better okay you have to focus on the screen look at the screen do not move your chair and then say tarmihim bihijaratim tarmihim bihijaratim yeah okay i will tell you a trick i will tell you a new trick you have to gather air in your lungs, hold your breath. Do not release it yet, and then you will be able to re read longer words, okay? Tarmihim bihijaratim. Like this. Wait, what? <laughs> before before reading, before, before starting to read, before starting to read, gather air in your lungs and hold it, and then read. Yeah. Tarmihim Bihija rotem. Good job. Tarmihim bihija rotem. Tarmihim bihija rotem. Yeah. Tarmihim bihija rotem. Taro me him be he jaro him. All right, the third part. Me. Me. So here we are apl applying you know, on this noon, we are applying ikhfa. Now we are going to combine these three parts together. Tar me him be he jaro him. Good job, good job. You are a genius. Only one thing. It's not tara, it's tar. Okay? Do not apply talqa on raw. Yeah, good job. Tarmihim bihijaratim Tarmihim Bihijaratin Yeah, seen will be connected with Jim. And Jim has a tashdi, so we will press the Jim for half a second. Then we will stretch the G 
for one second because of the yai mother rule. So sit jil. Sit jil. Good boy, good boy. Tarmihim bi hijaratim min sijil. Jil. Yeah, the complete thing from here. Tarmihim bi hijaratim min sijil. Good job, good job, good job. You're doing great, mashallah. Tarmihim bi hijaratim min sijil. Tarmihim bi hijaratim min sijil. Good boy, you are a genius. Okay. Just repeat after me. Sadaqallahul. Sadaqallahul. Azim. Azim. Good boy. MashaAllah, you did well, man. Today you worked really hard. All right. -o. One more verse and this surah is complete. You will be able to recite one complete surah, man. That's great. You only mm. only one verse is left, inshallah. We will learn this uh, on Monday now. And uh, let me give you the points, man. You deserve a lot of points today. First of all, you deserve two more levels. So you will be raised to for yeah, you will be up you will be promoted to level forty six from level forty four to forty six because you worked really hard. Uh, and secondly, I will give you one hundred thousand points, man. You deserve 100,000 points. So I hope that this video was useful for you. If it is so, then please like it, comment on it, share it, and subscribe my channel. Wish you best of luck. Inshallah, we will meet in the next video. Assalamu alaikum. Bye-bye.